हाइडेंटॉइन सिंथेसिस फॉर अमीनो एसिड इस वाले मेथड के अंदर वी कैन प्रिपेयर पर्टिकुलर द ट्रिप्टोफेन अमीनो एसिड्स तो यहाँ जो हम बनाएंगे बाय दिस हाइड्रेटॉइन सिंथेसिस वी प्रिपेयर द वी विल प्रिपेयर दिस ट्रिप्टोफेन अमीनो एसिड वी विल प्रिपेयर द ट्रिप्टोफेन अमीनो एसिड फ्रॉम द हाइडेंटॉइन सिंथेसिस so what is this hydantoin hydantoin we have to prepare this hydantoin first in the reaction or in the uh, reaction so it involves the condensation of the aromatic aldehyde yaha we use the aromatic aldehyde aur uska aromatic aldehyde ka hydantoin se iska reaction karayenge to uh, we require this indol we required this indol that is the one of the heterocyclic compound that is aromatic heterocyclic compound and it is known as indol this is known as indol when this indol undergo the ramatimer reaction we know this ramatimer reaction is taking place in presence of chloroform and base and by heating it so when we are using this chloroform and nuh and heating it is a ramatimer reaction to isse kya banta hai aldol will converted into aldol will converted into the indol 3 carbaldehyde that will converted into like this and this is the indol and indol may third position will be change into the coh group so here we get this uh, cho and this is the aromatic aldehyde is formed by uh, reacting the indol with the chloroform and the nuh so this is the indol this is indol 3 carbaldehyde this is indol 3 carbaldehyde is there Uh, to uh, uh, to react the hydantoin with this this is the aldehyde so what is the hydantoin is now let's see what is the hydantoin is so when we react this indol 3 carbaldehyde with hydantoin that is nh this is c double bond o nh c double bond o and this bond this is known as hydantoin this is known as hydantoin so that's why the uh, the this method is also known as the hydantoin synthesis so it is the hydantoin is there so main reaction is between this hydantoin and the uh, um, this aromatic aldehyde which is formed from the indol so when there are indol 3 carbaldehyde and we have the this hydantoin what happen they are react each other in presence of in presence of acetic anhydride that is acetic anhydride is this this is react with acetic anhydride here plus acetic anhydride and another thing we required is uh, sodium acetate then second thing for this reaction is the sodium acetate is required so what happen when these are react with each other here we have when these are react with each other so we can remove this and now what happen i can write the cho like this suppose we are writing this aldehyde like this okay so this oxygen and this h2 
this H2 and this oxygen will lost. So what we lost, that is the water molecule is lost when the hydrogen toin and this aromatic aldehyde react with each other. So the reaction is taking place at the at indole at carbon number three where the carbaldehyde group is present and that removal of the H2 molecule will be there. So we get to hydrogen toin it form a double bond between the carbon CHN uh, between the carbon of uh, hydrogen toin and that is the hydrogen toin is this C double bond O this is C double bond O NH and this is the uh, formation of a condensed product between the carbaldehyde, uh, indole carbaldehyde and the hydrogen toin. So this is the formed and that is the condensation product. That is the condensation, condensation product is there. This is the formation of the condensation product. Why it is condensation product? Because what is the condensation? Removal of some uh, small uh, molecules like water molecules or alcohols. So here there is a removal of H2O molecules. So it is the condensation reaction. When uh, this is formed, when this is formed, this is now uh, when we do the reduction then we are doing the reduction and the reduction is taken place by using the sodium amalgam and that is the reduction that is the reduction of this condensation product so when we do the reduction what we get we get this again this indole this indole is there and we do the uh, this reduction here. So, what will happen? So, we are reduction. Kar rahe hai, when we are doing the reduction, this part is converted into alkene. So, here, this reduction will happen. First thing, we have to keep in mind. This carbon ka reduction will happen. And then it will give you when this reduction is there so this will convert it into ch2 so first thing this is converted into ch2 on reduction with the sodium amalgam then this carbon that is converted into now ch and baki this is nh c double bond o this is c double bond O and that is NH and this so on the on the reduction on the reduction of this by using sodium amalgam the reduction of this bond is taken place so reduction of this bond is taken place so it will convert it into CH CH2 and the CH then we do the hydrolysis we do the hydrolysis of this product hydrolysis of this product and in that hydrolysis we have H plus and that is H2 molecule so all this that is uh, which is formed by the reduction that will convert it into uh, here the bond cleavage is taking place from here this part will go away and this part will go away so this part will go away so what will happen CH2 this is CH and, and that will convert it into NH2 and this part will convert it into acid part so the finally finally we get like this that is NH and that is converted into this is the CH2 on hydrolysis cleavage of bond is taking place from this and this so this NH is converted uh, this is the CH and that NH this NH is converted into NH2 here and this part 
this part is converted into the asset group this part is converted into asset group so this is the formation of a drift of it this is the formation of a to fan amino acid so by hydrantoin synthesis we can prepare a tryptophan amino acid by using this hydrantoin that is the in this uh, it is the condensation of uh, aromatic aldehyde with hydrantoin in presence of acetic acid acetic sorry acetic anhydride and what this sodium acetate and then that condensation product thus obtained and we do the reduction we do the reduction with the sodium amalgam or the ammonium hydrogen sulfide we are using this sodium amalgam here we are using the sodium amalgam here and and by then we are doing this acid hydrolysis when we do the head acid hydrolysis that will give you the alpha amino acid and this particular amino acid this particular amino acid is known as the tryptophan so by this we can prepare the tryptophan by the hydrantoin synthesis